Hey guys, it's KJ48, and welcome back to my Subnautica Let's Play. This is Season 3, Episode 9, and today we are going to go farm up some materials because I want to continue working on my base. Um, I think I'm going to do one more base building video, and then I'm going to stop and go do some exploration. Um, I was thinking I could either grab these signals and see what see what those are, or I could go in the main big ship and try and repair it. Uh, I think I'm going to grab these signals uh, next video. Uh, yeah, I'll grab these signals and see where they take me. But for now, let's uh, let's go get some materials and uh, make this base. Now, we're not going to be going anywhere really far, so I'm not going to... Well, I guess I should take the uh, Cyclops because it does allow me... Well, you know what? I don't have anything in the Cyclops that can hold anything yet. But it would make sense to take the Cyclops and then transfer stuff. Um, yeah, yeah, let's take the Cyclops. All right. it's, it'll be fun to drive this thing around. By the way, um, I haven't put up episode 8 yet, so I don't have a name for the Cyclops as of right now. But um, as soon as that episode goes up, the next one I make, I will uh, I will definitely name this sucker. Alright, so we're going to need two things here. We're going to need a lot of uh, metal. And we are also going to need... Actually, hold on. Before we go anywhere... Before we go anywhere... Uh, there's two things I want to make in the Cyclops. I want to make... I don't have my builder thing with me, do I? No, I don't. Let's go get our builder thing. I'm not gonna need the. Uh, I'm not gonna need the sea moth. Let's just go in like this. So there's a couple things I want to make in the uh, cyclops. For those of you who haven't watched my earlier seasons, you can um, actually make stuff in the cyclops just like you can inside your base. So, uh, two things I want to make in the cyclops is a storage container, which is gonna be a locker, and the other thing I'm gonna want to make is going to be. Uh, a, 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 a fabricator so let's come on in here and let's grab our building thingy bob if I can find it it should organize these inventories at some point uh, building thing it's kind of weird that I put the building thing away I usually don't do that there it is all right so let's see we're gonna need the builder thingy and let's see what we're gonna need for it for the fabricator we're gonna need titanium and for the chest, I think we need the lockers. We're gonna need titanium and glass. So let's grab that right now. Titanium. You know what? Let's also grab some water. Um, we got enough health kits. Let's take. Uh, we're not gonna. Oh yeah, we are gonna need some glass. I don't think we have any made glass. So let's take some quartz and make some glass. So instead, if you hold shift, the recipe will stay up here. So let's see. Shift. Oh, there you go. All right. So if you hold shift and left click, the uh, recipe actually stays up there for you. Pretty cool. Thank you for the tips, guys. I, a couple of you guys gave me that tip. And um, I really appreciate it. All right. We're going to find some more salt. I want to start cooking fish. I know I said it was a waste, and it kind of is, but I'm getting sick of eating those mushrooms. It takes forever to eat them. These storage containers are empty. Yes. Okay. Let's get back to the sub. So yeah, um, I know fish is kind of a you know a waste of salt in a way, but at the same time, I'm getting a little tired of um, you know, I'm just getting tired of eating the damn uh, mushrooms. It just takes forever, uh, and I seem to be getting a decent amount of salt. So, I see this just you gotta pick them all up, and then, and then you gotta go through and click them and eat them. It's just it's kind of annoying. Wouldn't be so bad if you get a lot of salt. And I do have a good amount of salt. Now, salt's used for two things. Salt is used for water, and salt is also used for health kits. Both are very important. Um, you can make you can make water without the salt, but uh, it's kind of annoying. You have to grab one of those um, air fish or something, and it's just a pain in the ass. And the water is only half as good as the water you can make with the salt. So I really like using salt for water. Salt's also used for health kits. It's very important. Um, so I don't like throwing away salt. And if, you know... Oh, boy. I just, and if you're eating, if you're cook, if you're using the salt to cook fish, you're kind of, you know, you're kind of wasting your time because you could just eat this acid, these acid mushrooms. The thing about having the fish is, once you've cooked up some fish, you can carry that with you in your inventory and actually have a sustainable meal. You can't really carry the mushrooms with you because they, there's, you know, you have to eat so many, you know, so it doesn't really make sense. Let's go ahead and drink one of these. There we go. Honestly, if people wanted to play this game without the hunger and thirst meter, I wouldn't have a problem with it. Um, I do it just because I'm a survival guy, 
But uh, honestly, the hunger and thirst meter is basically just a time sink, and you know, I don't know. I, I kind of wish I could grow my own food or somehow produce my own food. Uh, right now, f getting food in this game is only a grind. It's only, you know, you just going out and getting it. And that's not always fun. All right, so there we go. Okay, you're good. And now let's make one locker. One locker will be good enough for now. We'll put that right here. Mm, yes. Okay, and let me meet my phone. Sorry, that is very, very unprofessional of me. Okay, there we go. Put that away. Oops. Get in the locker, damn it. There you go. Put the salt away, glass, titanium. Keep the battery. I don't know why we have two knives. That's kind of weird, but um, we'll put those away. <laughs> two knives, like, what's up with that? All right, let's get in the control panel. All right, and let's go this way. I'm not going to go too far. Uh, what I'm looking for is uh, quartz, copper, and metal, basically. That's a good spot. Let's go down a little bit. That's good, that's good, that's good. Don't go any farther. Okay, that's good. Let's get out of this. Let's get into our seam off and go, uh, go get some... Go get some materials. There we go. Gonna have to watch out for stalkers here, but you know, whatevs. Alright. The thing is, you don't really want to get hit by stalkers, because as far as I know, there's only one way to uh, to bring back your hit points, and that's by medkits. And medkits, because of the salt, is, uh, you know, you don't want to be throwing away medkits. So, yeah. Uh, again, people told me you can uh, tame the stalkers, but it, it, it honestly sounds like a big freaking headache. So I don't think I'm going to bother. Something uh, You have to feed them. At first I was told you have to feed them. Then I was told you have to feed them three times. Then I was told you have to feed them five times. And uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll mess around them at some point towards the end of the Let's Play, like when I'm getting bored and there's nothing left to do. But right now I'm just not really that concerned with it. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll look up how to do it. But possibly, possibly. But um, honestly, I really don't care that much. Ooh, there they are. Right now, I'll just kill them. Why, why tame a creature when you can kill it? Oh, these stupid things. I hate these things. Hmm. The, I figured what they're called, like, those life leeches things. By the way, um, if you keep your health... If you keep your, um, your thirst and hunger meter f more full I was told those life leech things are easier to like get off you so that's pretty interesting so let's keep those uh let's keep our thirst and and uh, hunger meter full Gotta be careful there Alright, there's a there's some quartz down there, but I don't know. I really don't want to get in the way of lava, you know. Yeah, we really need some more salt. Really need more salt. Like tons of salt. Oh, someone else is telling me to uh, do something with a terraformer. And they said you start off with the terraformer. Uh, I think it's kind of random because I did not start off with a terraformer. And as a matter of fact, I don't even think I can make one right now. I think I need to find the blueprint. Um, so, I don't think I can make a terraformer yet. Let me uh, look in here. Blueprints. Yeah, I don't see it anywhere. Yeah, I can't make the terraformer yet. So I'll keep an eye out for the blueprints, guys. By the way, those are the peepers you want to you want to catch. There's a, something called a gravity sphere, which is really great for um. Oh, what the hell is that? Did you see that? What was that? Probably, uh, you know what, I probably shouldn't even mess around. Yeah, it looked like it was just like a lava chunk or something. Let's get out of here. Uh, yeah, the peepers. Yeah, so there's this grav sphere you can use to catch fish. Which is really awesome. Oh, I'm back to my house already. Uh, yeah, grav sphere you can use to catch fish. I think I'll make one of those. And we'll start catching peeper fish. 
just so when it's time to uh, maybe you know maybe cook some fish, I will have some. Or if I decide I want to feed them to the uh, to the stalkers, I can do that because the peeper fish what you have to feed to the stalkers. They're the fastest fish uh, that I'm aware of. They also give the most health back or most um, hunger back. So I'm gonna want to catch some of those. Those things right there, their uh, tails emit like some kind of poison cloud. So if you go near it, like if they feel threatened, they'll they'll emit the poison. And uh, if you go into it, you could like take damage or something. I've never done it, but that's what I've been told. That's some gold. This is a strange place for gold. Where that? Did I get it? The metal? Uh, yeah, I did. Yeah, this is pretty high up for gold. I'm surprised. By the way, at nighttime, the stalkers are super aggressive. So we should probably kind of be careful. As a matter of fact, let's get back to the sub and uh, empty our inventory. It's a good time to do it since it's dark. Where is the sub anyway? Leave me alone. Oh, these freaking things. I hate these damn things. I hate you. God, I hate them. They're so freaking annoying. They're hard to see too, so it's not even like I can live it. Maybe. Like shoot them once I get the stasis rifle. I never see them till the till they're on me, you know. Well, All right. Oh, this way. Okay. Now with our neat little shift trick. There we go. Check it out. Awesome. Awesome. I love it. You could turn titanium into ingots. I wonder if you could turn the ingots back into back into titanium, because that would be helpful. <laughs> you know, let's take this one out, and turn that into titanium. There we go. four pieces of salt that's that's the reason I don't want to lose health though because if I have to replace my med kits that takes salt and that really sucks all right we're gonna go out at night we'll look for quartz at night oh careful that shouldn't your own ship dumbass Come here, peeper. Come here. Stop. 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 There we go. Let's grab some of this. Oh, some unguarded metal. Very nice. No crappy stalkers around. We gotta keep hitting these rocks for the uh, for the copper. Copper is really important for our, our batteries, power source, whatever you want to call it. They're basically batteries. I think I'm gonna make that uh, that graph sphere next time I'm out here. I want to catch some peepers. Gotta keep an eye out for salt. Salt is really important. Salt's really hard to find, man. Like, it's it's probably my most, like, difficult resource to maintain, you know? Actually, there's no maybe about it. It is. Wish I had some kind of, like, salt detector or something.
What is that? Seamoth probably, right? Yep. Come on, where's the salt, dude? Alright, let's get back in the Seamoth. Go to a different spot. It looks like we're just going over the same spot over and over. Okay. This looks like a new spot. Let's go ahead and save, just in case. Never know when you're going to die in this game. Boomerang fish. They're not worth cooking. The only the only fish you really want to cook is the peeper fish. Although there is some like other fish deep down, like I think they're called spearhead fish or something, or spades or something. I forget what they're called, but uh, they're not bad either. But those are the only two ones that I'm aware of that are worth it. We're bound to find some crash in here, right? Right? Oh, it's getting dark. That's where we need a flashlight. I don't really like coming down here because of the crash fish. I'll eventually explore caves. I just want to get a flashlight and a dive reel. A dive reel is something you kind of like... And maybe an extra air tank, but a dive reel is something you put on the sur like towards the surface, and like you leave it there, and it goes off on a long spool, and then that way you could find your way out just by following the uh, um, the string, basically. Uh, but I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna need a couple things. So I'm gonna need a flashlight, a dive reel, and another air tank. At least another air tank, maybe two. Look, like there's a lot of salt around here. Unless I'm missing it. Hmm. Oh man, there's no salt. Like, <laughs> this game needs more salt. I need, I need a way to farm salt or something. We should catch some of those air, air sack fish. It's a way for us to get water without needing salt. Oh crap, you see there's the... the poison. Of oxygen yeah, yeah, I hear you. Willie hears you. Willie don't care. Alright. Peeper? Yeah, forget the peeper for now. Forget the peeper fish for now. just want to find salt there's some this will be the last video of me uh, farming for stuff at least this close to the surface um, farming metal salt and and quartz from now on will be done off camera this will be the last one because there's not much to talk about there's not much to show I wanted to show you that this really like in-depth farming thing uh, just so you could see maybe where to find stuff or how I found it but after this it's going to start being done off camera, for sure. Because... Well, you've seen where to get it now. Showing you this over and over is kind of pointless. Right, we are almost full. Probably do some farming while I watch some, a stream or something. Usually when I'm going to farm off camera, I put on someone's stream. Maybe get in TeamSpeak and I just farm. Uh, when you get into TeamSpeak or watch someone else's stream while farming in a game like this, before you know it, you've got like tons of materials and you don't even remember doing it. It's really, it's really a good way to go, for sure. But again, I don't know what's with the salt. 
Sometimes I find a lot of it, sometimes not so much. Uh, it just seems kind of random at the moment. Games in alpha, I mean, they're gonna have to... You know, when you're making a game in alpha, the last thing you care about is balancing. You know, it's, it's not really a concern. Although, when you're making a game like this for alpha and you're selling it, you want people to be, be uh, entertained, you gotta balance it a little bit. And I do think these these ga these kind of games are pretty balanced. Balance is why I stopped playing Unturned, because um, Unturned used to be a really cool uh, alpha game. And then uh, they started doing Unturned 2 or whatever, or he started doing Unturned 2. And then he just stopped balancing it, and he just put all the guns in the game, because he wanted everyone to get the guns right away. And without the balance, that game just sucks. You know? The balance is what makes it fun. So. New creature, discovered. New creature huh? What was that? Oh, yeah, the peeper. Maybe I should cook it. Eh, let's cook it up. Why not? It'll give us, like, something we can take on our way. Like, if we gotta go somewhere like, really deep. Alright. Can't make any bleach because we know the calcium chunks. Make some titanium. Alright, guys. I am going to call this one here. I'm thinking next video we will... Uh, well, there's two things I want to do. I wanted to go into the ship. And I wanted to go. I thought I wanted to go exploring. Now I don't remember what I was. Now I remember what I was saying at the beginning of the video. Let me watch the video back. Uh, I'll probably go either going to the ship or do something else interesting, but it won't be building um, or farming. All right, guys. So that's gonna be it for episode nine. We'll see you next time for episode ten. Till then, take it easy.